so hard to see him like this. He was so full of life, so strong. Excuse me, Mrs. Lopez Fitzgerald. I just need to check on Antonio. I'll only be a moment. Nurse, has there been any change in his condition at all? I'm afraid not. We just have to wait. There's no timetable for when the drug will take effect. Or if it will. All we can do is pray that the drug works, Mama. Hey, you'll need your privacy. No, think. Don't go. Stay. Antonio needs every prayer he can get. How is he? He's the same, but with God's help, he'll recover. You did the right thing, Sheridan. Giving him the drug, you gave him a chance to live. Thank you for that, Sheridan. Just want to do what's right for Antonio. Maybe we should let Sheridan have some time alone with him. Yeah. Right. We'll be outside if there's any change. I'll let you know. Lara, um, we're, we're going to go now. But we'll be at home, okay? So if anything changes, I'll call you. Thanks. Thanks for coming, Ethan. No problem. Thanks, boy. Teresa, I, uh, I know you're probably going to want to be here with your family, so don't, don't worry about work tomorrow. I'll take care of everything and cover all your meetings. Oh, I'll be at work in the morning as usual. Um, we're meeting with that NPS corporation, and we need to go over the details together. Okay, fine. I'll see you at the office. Okay. Night, everyone. Night. Thanks Night. again. I think you should go home. Little Ethan should be with his mommy. You're right, Mama. I, I better go. Will you call me if anything changes? Of course. Okay, bye. 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 Teresa.